Hello and welcome to MLB The Show 18 for your Minnesota Twins franchise. How you doing, everybody? Eric Emman, Twins 28 here. We are on episode 14, and we are about to start game two of the three-game set against the Chicago Cubbies. And game one, we did pretty good against the Cubs. We uh, knocked them around pretty good. And uh, we're in game two now. And as you know, in the last episode, right at the tail end, we made a trade. We got an old friend back in the Twins family, Brian Dunzing. Noticed he was pitching for the Cubs, and... Decided to get him back. I like him. I like always like Brian Dunsing, so he's back. He's wearing his number 52. He is in the bullpen right now. And um, I made some roster moves, which I'll show you at the end of the at the end of the episode here. Um, and uh, do, 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 what else did I do? I made a couple. Uh, no, I didn't make it a couple of changes. Okay, so um, this lineup today is going to be a little different. Uh, a few guys needed some rest, um, as you can see by the starting lineup. I'm going to show you right here. Uh, Maurer is, of course, on the bench because it's National League Park. And Morrison's doing pretty good. Actually, let me think here. Lomo, he plays outfield. You know what, Lomo's... Uh, Batista's in a little funk right now. Let's put Batista. Let's sit Batista. Let's get Maurer up. Yeah, let's go lefty heavy here. We got a left hander here. So I like Defoe, but I'm going to put him lower in the lineup. I'm going to put Maurer there. Let's put Defoe. Defoe's hitting pretty good. I'll put him sixth. There we go. Okay, so here's how we're going to. This is what we're going to do today. Okay, so Batista's got the day off because he's tired. And he's also cold. Sano needs a day off. Bucks needs a day off. Kepler, he's okay, so he might come out the bench, pinch hit. Um, Pilecki needs a day off. Escobar needs a day off. Batista's just cold right now. And we're going against a lefty, so uh, I got Granite in center. He's the fastest guy right now. And he's been hitting the ball good that last game. He's like three for four or four for five, whatever it was. Granite's doing great. He deserves a shot at starting. Maurer's in the game. He's a first base. As always, bat in second. Uh, I got Toscar Hernandez playing in right, bat in third. He's got some power in his bat. Uh, Rosario in his customary fourth slot, playing second. Morrison, he's going to play in the outfield. I'm actually going to swap him and Hernandez. We'll put Logan in right. Wilmer Defoe, he's batting 436. I got him at third today. And then I got Kyle Farmer, the catcher, the backup. Batting eighth, Adrianza at short, and then Michael Pineda, who's 11 and two, batting ninth against John Lester, the lefty. So this will be a fun game. So I got two lefties a righty, two lefties, switch hitter, righty, switch hitter, righty. So we got a nice potpourri of a well, lineup, and we're 20 games over 500 against the 47 and 35 Chicago Cubs. So this will be a good game. So I can't wait to see this one. So I'm thinking after this series, we're gonna sim ahead and probably get to the um, All-Star game. So, and then after that, we got the Doesn't trade deadline coming up. But I don't think this. I don't after see us taking any more trades. I think we're doing pretty good. Today, it's the second of this three. We got a lot of players I like John that Lester I wanted. So. On the mound for game two. It's like John exactly Lester's got an impressive record, hey, Matty, too. We're getting a chance to watch a guy that's been struggling a little bit lately. In his last three starts, he has a whip of over 1.40. So he's going to have to cut that down, limit the amount of base runners, limit the amount of walks if he wants to have some success in this one here today. Okay, Zach, here we go. Underway at the ballpark this afternoon as the first pitch is in there for strike one. Dan Dero, the Cubs, as they take the field here this afternoon. They dropped another one last time out, and in fact, they've won just twice Morris. in their last eight tries. Yeah, Clouds Maddie, are game, really I, moving they, fast. They, they got to wash that down the drain. They got absolutely boat raced by a big. See if margin. they give me another sinker here. Yep. Them. Show up to the yard today. Look at. Yeah, I'd be careful, fight. Zach. He's been hitting really good lately. Once the first pitch is thrown. I now hope he keeps it going. I really would love him to be now. my starter, but, you know, I got so many good players, it's hard to find spots for everybody. First pitch so I'm going to try and use Zach a little more. And base hit. All right. Field, line drive I really like Zach, so, so I want to get him. I want to use him a little more, so started. we'll see. Maybe I have to train to be a first baseman. He could play a little first base. That could be something. Well, here's Maurer. I'm gonna, I'm gonna 
Hold off on stealing here just now. And the 34-year-old veteran looks at a called strike. It's 0-1. Okay. Let's see. Lester Let's get, both great see if I can get Granite to steal here. It'll be tough because it's against win. the lefty, oh, and he's... Poor base go, go, go. running there. Got him caught in a hot box between first and second. The tag, and he is cooked at first. Well, that's not a good look. No one likes getting picked off, but it's especially bad when it's your team's first hit. It's kind of deflated. Ugh. Bases are empty, one man out. That's not good. Gets a great hit, and then he goofs on the hit. And ground ball, so that probably would have been a double play anyway, so. Throw to first is in time oh. as Maurer becomes out number two. Yep. And now oh, well. look at the Minnesota Twins starting oh, lineup. Who do you have your eye on, Dan? Well, right now they're looking for Joe Maurer to turn things around. He went 0 for 4 last game, and I just didn't like the way he went about it. Looked like they completely overpowered him, and, and that's not something we're used to seeing out of this guy. Hopefully, he'll be able to put that behind him. Slaps that one away, and the count will be nothing in one. I know it's a guessing game, but usually when you flip that, this is going to be a hard game to get some runs, especially when I got most of my hitter, my power hitters and starters sitting on the bench. So this is going to be a tough game for us. This might be a little scoring one, but we'll see. Things are things that happen. A solid start to this one for John Lester. Now the Cubbies will get their first. So I hope you guys are enjoying all the action I've been getting on my channel lately. I've been trying to get all the videos I've been shooting that have been shot for the last month updated, uploaded. And I've been doing one video a day for my Vikings trying to get that season one done and I'm close. Come on Zach, Zach, Zach. Nice catch. So that season one's almost done for Vikings and then I'm working along this one and then I got I've been resurrecting GTA Online with the PS4, but now I'm going to be getting going on PS4 on uh, GTA Online with the computer, so that's going to be fun. There are a couple other games I'm looking at. Uh, hopefully I can get working, so. Uh, a lot of flurry of action on my channel here, so hope you guys are enjoying it. There's a fly to the left. I think... Yeah, toast guard with that one. But he makes the catch in front of the Ivy for out number two. Nice beard, I like that. Here's Chris Bryant. All right, two up, two down, baby. Here we go. Pineda's been really good. I got a feeling he might be in the All-Star game. And he misses with a high changeup that time. Doing too bad after that surgery he had on his elbow. In this one, behind the plate is Patrick Johnson. Yeah, Dan, we got Patrick Johnson behind the dish, and I fairly standard strike zone most of the time, but he's definitely a pitcher's umpire. I got him. Like Oop, excuse me, I was only strike two. All right, let's get a slider, try and get him to go I outside. He's a fair umpire, but I would rate him more as a pitcher. Got him. Swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will That was do outside. It. Cubs are down All right. Order. Still no score. Off the number four Minnesota hitter, Eddie Rosario. Come on, Eddie. Started in the top of the second. Right up the middle. All right, Eddie. So that puts the leadoff man aboard to get the inning underway. Obvious pitch recognition right there. God, I love the stadium. I really want to do it. I, I was, I was thinking about doing that. Franchise with the Cubs, and uh, when I was doing MLB 17, but then when they won the World Series, it's like, well, I want to take a team that hasn't won it in a long, long time or ever. So, um, if I decide to do another team after the Twins won here, maybe do the, uh, the Pirates. I got. I like the Pirates and I love their stadium. Gorgeous stadium. With the Diamondbacks. I'm thinking of the Diamondbacks, maybe. So. This is the final year of his current deal, so he'll be a free agent so we'll see. End. You know, Matty, I know he's in the final I'll just hang on to the Twins. I don't know. I got so much stuff going on here. I might not have time for another franchise. I might be busy doing other stuff. And I might do the road show. Make my own character. So we'll see how things go. Here it comes, the 3-0. He's taken strike one. Pretty good pitch to hit there that he let go. I know it's early and probably wanting to run his pitch. See if he tries to sweep and curve on me. He hasn't thrown like it yet, so. Swing at the rest of the game. Four, four. Nice job. So I've been doing a lot better walk, with those walks. And first and second with nobody out. If you've seen my videos from uh, MLB 17, my first right that start the series. I was terrible at taking walks, but this one's been a lot better. 
and I've been recognizing really be bad focused. pitches. I've been getting Indiana's better at it and being more patient. High batting average. Definitely one of the most right. dangerous hitters in the league these Come days. on, Wilmer. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Drill to the base right hit. Side. And that's through into right field right. for a base hit. And they're content to play station to station here as okay. the bases nice are loaded now with still nobody out. Boy, Dero, we're looking at a big inning right here with that single. Bases are loaded, yet no runs have scored in this inning. Yeah, and that's exactly Okay, who's this? Oh, this is Farmer. Oh, boy. You have to eliminate the noise, Dan. Give me a sinker. Just try and drive in the guy from third base. Don't put pressure on Go. yourself. That you have to Go. Everyone in with one oh, that one's going to gonna score a run at least. And keep the line move. Yeah, well, at least he'll get one. Oh, oh that guy's out. Damn. And he is out at third base. It's a double play. The next twin up, Ari Adrianza. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> Got one run. Come on, Ari. First offering on its way. Ah. So we have the bases loaded, and we only got one lousy run. Wow. Okay. That was not good. <laughs> okay. So let's see here. Struck him out. Fly out. Strike out. Nice job. Pineda's looking good. Speaking of which. Let's see if he can help his cause here. Nope. There's one well above the zone for a ball. I'm still amazed by that hit from Ryu in the last game where he got a three run a tri uh, three run double to help his cause out to right field. That was pretty cool. Bases clearing double by an AL pitcher who came from the NL. So, ooh, look at that one. Look at that one. Oh, he almost got a hit. That was a good ride. Nice job, Pineda. He got some power on that one. That was a good hit. Just too much air. Zach Granite Not bad. Next to bat. One for one after a single this first time. At least he went down swinging. He didn't Third strike out. <laughs> the front, the first pitch. And the Granite. Line. That's foul. foul. There's that curveball. And another one. Oh, nice. And the throw here is gonna Got him. Get wow. Burn. Excellent range there at Buxton might have gotten that one up. Might have gotten beaten that. Digging in for his All right, here's Mauer. Joe Mauer. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. First delivery to him on the way. This is hit the that's other the way. That's the left field. That's going to be field. right at somebody. Schwarber coasts under it, and that retires the set. Hmm. All right. The next. That's whoa. Ah, John Lester. Oh, that was Hap with a home run. What? Oh, he reached on air. Feel this way. All right, good. So that'll bring in Teoscar. Okay, so we're tied up here. We begin the top of the fourth. Come on, Teoscar. See if he gives me a fastball. No. Nope. Swing and Gone. There it goes. He got all of this one. Yes. Into the bleachers and gone. I had a feeling they were gonna throw something right inside, so I, I guessed it, but it was the wrong pitch. But I still got it. I like this guy. He's got power. I had him in the uh, last franchise we did, 17. So glad I got him in this one. That was I got him in that Dozier hey, listen, trade. I'm starting to really solo home runs won't kill you. feel like I wish I hadn't traded lineup, Dozier. So I think I could have easily slid him over, but right the the I didn't want to lose him and not get anything in return. So maybe it was a good trade. Right now it's working out because Toscar's Standing doing now, good. So we'll see. The There's Rosie to deep center. He's going to have that one, though. Looks it into his glove, and there's one gone. All right. Now batting. Here's Lomo. In to try it again. Logan Morrison. One see if he throws me another so cutter. Yep. Ready to deliver. See if Here's I can crush one. Pitch. Nope. At right at the first base baseman. Right at Rizzo. Should have left that one alone. In once again. Come on, Same Wilmer. Last time up. 
Here comes the first pitch. Oh, what am I doing? Up and out of the zone, a swing and a miss. You know, we saw these guys around the cage during batting practice, and they told us they were going to be aggressive. I think this is getting a little ridiculous. They better run. Meanwhile, There's another here, one. Ball's given a pretty good ride out to deep left. Wilmer's field, got and one. And that is going to clear the wall. Oh, boy. Run. All right, Wilmer. God. He's doing good. I'm loving it. Solo shot here to I got him. First home run I also season, got him in the previous um, MLB that show 17. And I've actually had him before in 16 before I started doing these videos. He was always terrible for me. But now he's just, wow, it's just really good. Well, he won his last start, but he didn't give up any long balls. He's already given up two here. I so love this. This is awesome. It's sure making it hard to bring uh, Polanco he's back up. To start keeping the ball in the yard him starters. hitting so well and... Next up will be you know Kyle Escobar Farmer. doing well, and Andreanza is doing good, and now Farmer with a hit. All right. And that's going to get down in front of Hayward for a base Nice. Hit. All right. I wish uh, Garver would start hitting good. Right He's now. been terrible, right there. which is a shame because I like Garver. But Garver's so bad defensively, I might have to move him out of the catcher position and go some, put him somewhere else. I was thinking maybe outfield or first base. And that one is caught. Okay, so we got two runs that inning. Take the lead back. Okay, fast forward. Ground out. Double. Fly out. Strike out. No damage. And now the Twins pitcher, Michael Pineda, will start off the fifth in this one. First offering on its way. And a foul tip. Held foul on tip. To here. I hit the contact one. button on that one. I had a feeling he was going to throw one of those. Probably going to throw a sinker now. Nope. Fastball. Or cutter. Yeah, that was the cut. Yep. No, actually, that was a sinker. It was just a really high sinker. Now I'll go fastball. Still no balls and two strikes. He's fighting. Batter's going to have to find yep. a way to regroup right there. That caught too much of the plate. He knew it. He missed it. He might not get another opportunity to put the ball in play. There's a hit for drive to center field. Pineda. All right. And the pitcher's got himself a base hit. All right. So there'll be a man aboard here to Not start boy. out their half of the fifth. He came to play today. Not just only on the bump right there. He's thrown the ball well, but on the offensive side. Look at that. That was a nice, ha nice contact hit. That was a good hit. There you go, Pineda. All right. I always love it when a pitcher helps his cause out. All right, Granite. You're probably going to. Zach Granite, the next to bat. And yep. take a look Outside. at ball one. A See. Hit in two tries oh, wow. So far. How many outs do we have? Trying. Now a bunt attempt here, but a foul Oof, too much. One. I'm gonna see if I can. The one one. And now a bunt attempt here as he gets this one down. And that's out number all one. All right, yep. That's fine. Granite could try and beat it out, but that's all right. It's a sacrifice. He tried to surprise attack there with a bunt with a runner on base. Hey, he gets thrown out, but it works just as good as yep. a sacrifice. Yeah, because uh, Pineda doesn't run very well, so that's a good Standing hit. Now Maurer can try and get one in the gap. A fly out for him in his last trip. They're smart. They walk him. But Toscar is waiting on deck, too. He's ready. Here's the first offering. A ah, Maurer. Foul ball, however, strike one. Come on, Joe. Get that one in the gap here. Go opposite power here for Maurer. Nothing in Come one on, Maurer. Here it comes. There Lift you go. It down the line but it's going to go foul. And that will end up a foul ball. It's a jam shot here. Because they know he wants to go the other Balls way. And the o Ooh, he saw Damn it. With that one. Well, at least he moves the, the guy over. <laughs> I was right though. They were jamming him inside so he wouldn't extend his arms to shoot it down the line. So. But here's Toscar and he hit a home run last time. First delivery to him on the way. Popped him up. Ah shit. Baez calls for it. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. Well, he went inside on him. 
Okay, fast forward. Shit. Okay, got out of that one. Oh. Well, that wasn't Ian. Okay, 59 pitches. Uh, well, I can try. Okay, he's at 60 pitches now. Hats off to the pitcher right there. You got a great hitter at the plate. It's early in the count, and he wanted to get ahead. Nice challenge pitch right there. Okay, let's go slider inside here. Trying to hold the lead. Here's the delivery. Got him. And he struck him out. His seventh of the ball game, and that in. All right, good job, Pineda. All right, I got four, five, and six now. here. I'm figuring if I can get, if I don't get any more runs this inning before the pitcher comes up, six inning probably be it for Pineda. That's going to be tough. That's going to be tough. And I know I forgot it. Rosie doesn't run good in this game, which is stupid. Seriously, people, I've seen Eddie Rosario in person. I've watched him all the time. He's faster than that 59 rating. That's bullshit. Ready once again, Logan Morrison. I'm seriously considering actually well editing that. That's bat, just horse crap. He is at least a 70 or lower 80s. Ready with the first There's no pitch. way Here he's that comes. slow. This one smoked the other go, way. Go, go, go. Nope, foul. And he pushed it just a bit too much. And wind up a foul ball. Yeah, let's go sinker again. Nope. Yeah. The one fouled off, and he's quickly behind the one, too. Come on. 2 now from Lester. Just ah. got a piece up the line. Rizzo fields it That's cleanly. That's awful. And he'll take it to the That's terrible. For the out. Okay. And here's the full. Wilmer Defoe. He's off to a fast start in this one. Two for two, including a home run. Come on, Wilmer. Here's the first pitch to him. Popped him up. Oh, terrible. Shading to his wow. Wow. And the inning is over. I was actually aiming for... I was uh, swinging for the fences, and I just went up about 100 feet up in the air. Okay, let's go here. Fast forward. Oh, my God. Really? There's Joe Madden oh. up out of the dugout now on his way to home plate, so it looks as though he's going to call for the double switch here. Carl Edwards Jr. So we got six, and seven, eight, nine. In the lineup following the okay, so I'm going to have to. Uh, is also into the ball game, so uh, the number eight spot here. Well, Dunzing's not ready. I could go with Duffy, but he's gassed. So let's go with. Him. We're in the seventh. Let's go with Rosenthal. Yeah. Here comes the first pitch. Hit on the ground is Crap. short. Russell has it. And the throw to first is in time, so the leadoff man is gone here to start inning number seven. All right, he's on Gianza. Digging in the switch hitter, Harry Adrianza. Gotta hope for a hit. Some runs here so uh, Pineda can get the win. So I'm about to pull him. Went about halfway oh. there, but it's a called strike regardless. Yeah, I'm gonna put Rosenthal in the. Uh... Yeah, he's gotta. I gotta schedule him. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. Oh. Swinging strike, and now it's over. God, Adrianza, come it's on, amazing. dude. I tell so many fans, you get in a box one time, the one pitch you're gonna swing at more than any other is that elevated fastball. Your and a shortstop, of, of course. Player, and you just cannot get to it. And that's the second out. What the hell was that? The pitcher number 35. Yep. Michael Pineda. You know, Pineda's. Doing a good job. I mean, always he's giving up a couple rounds here. I really need a. I need a bloop and a. I need a blast in a bad way. What kind of pitchers. Stepping into is the box, lefty or a righty? It is a. Okay, it is a. It's a righty. Okay. Yes. I'm on a right. I'm on a lefty. Let's go Kepler. Well, wait a minute. It's my one lefty left. Ugh. Buxton. Hmm. 
Uncle Batista. I know he's cold, but I don't want to use Kepler just yet. Maybe Batista will surprise and give us a crap. Give us a bomb here. Maybe lucky to make contact there as this curveball's hit fouled off to the left-hand side. 261, the average coming into action here. 11 home runs and 46 driven in. Is swung on and driven out Go. to right center field. The Go. Ball is well hit. Go. And yes. All right, lead. Batista. Oh, yes. Well, that just put uh, Pineda in the winning circle right now. Home run that time off the bat of Jose Batista. 12 home All right, Batista. Now thank you. Take the lead four to three. I'll take it. About 375. Oh, the nice. We needed We're that. Watching an impressive power display today. With that one, these two teams have now hit a combined five homers in this game. Not gonna say how far. This is turning into home run derby part Okay, two. granite. Five bombs already. I want another one. We need some extra insurance. I said we're, this is probably gonna be a low-scoring game, so it's only four-three. It's somewhat low, but. Nice to see Batista get a big hit there. We needed it from him. Oh, come on, Granite. Come on, kid. Oh, this could be this could be it. This could be it. Go. 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 Hey, I don't mind you throwing a what? fastball in this situation, but I think, if we're being honest with ourselves, oh my. that one caught a little bit too much of the plate. Grounded up the first baseline. Oh, how did that and not go out? And the count holds it oh, 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 Granite had a bomb there. Here comes okay, he's going to go deep on this one. Come on, baby. Now he goes the other way. Uh, and got I don't... Of it high mm, and it's close, eh? Gone. All right, Granite. Yes. That's what we needed. All right. Opposite field so for Granite. Shot here to left center field. His first home run of the season. And His first one of the year. Good for him. Good timing. And a boy. Nice job. This is what you do to stay in the lineup there, kid. I'm telling you. You got style. He's got speed. He's got some power. A little power. Yeah. All right, here's Maurer. Some Maurer power now. So here's Joe Maurer. Right up the middle. Classic Maurer. All right. And a good effort on the dive that time, but this will get by him for a base hit. Yeah, I don't know if I love the approach of pulling the trigger on that low okay. pitch. I can't imagine that's exactly what he's looking for. The result works. All right. Here's Hernandez. He's got one homer. Come on, so baby. That'll bring in Teoscar Hernandez. Ooh. He'll come up empty there as Hacked he misses on the one. off speed pitch for strike <laughs> one. He's working All on right. a one for three thus far. He's ready. Here's the 0 1. Hard hit ball to second. Nice. Quite get high enough to pull I'm going to hold off. Yep. Right center, All right. And you know what? I'm go going no to. Second, as there are two aboard I'm going to do. Okay. Hang on a second. So with We're going to call off the. To their own left He's coming in, but I'm going to cancel this. I'm going to cancel it. Because I'm going to do the double switch. There's a huge swing by Rosario and There's a Rosie. It's right gone. And he will get there to oh, the he caught it. And that will end the inning. Oh, so that was close. Runs. At the plate, Peter Borges. He's newly entered into the ball game, so this will be his first trip to the plate here in inning number seven. Oh. Even though we're moving into the back end of this game, they're only down by a couple of runs. You know that old slow no, and a move and a blast. They could certainly do that. use that right what now. What the hell? Ready with the first pitch. Huh. Here it comes. Interesting. A change up over the inside oh, corner. Man. On its way, the 0-1 pitch. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Rosario trying to get there. 
He makes the catch. A great effort to get there and record the first down of the inning. Addison. Digging in and looking for more. Addison Russell hoping to build off that RBI double from his last plate appearance. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. And that pitch catches the inside corner. The wind up and the 0 1. Sinking liner toward left. Uh, this will hang up just long enough to be run down in shallow left for a tough second out. Here's Jason Hayward now. He steps in off a base hit in his last at bat. First pitch on its way. And they'll try and get him out in front to start the at bat, but this misses off the plate away. It's ball one. The wind up and the 1 0 pitch. And that pitch catches the inside corner. The 1 1. 1 and 2 now. So we got Jose Batista on the mound here. I tried putting Rose. I tried doing the, trip, the, the double switch, but it wouldn't let me do it. So Batista is actually doing a pretty good job here. Oh my God, look at that. He just struck out Hayward. <laughs> Awesome. Got a home run and a strikeout. Nice job there, Batista. All right. All right, so let's do this. Let's put... Yes, he's catching the pitch here. If you hear a baby crying in the background, that's my son sitting next to me. He doesn't want to sleep. Yeah, don't you? Nope. Get off me, ball. That ball's way too far inside. He's got to step out of the box right now and adjust his batting gloves because he just got stung by a pack of wasps. Takes a pitch high and away for ball one. Hi. You say hi to everybody? Huh? You say hi? Yeah, hi. That's my little GC right there. The one one home. Is looked at for ball number Ooh, two. Oh, I think we need to take a break, folks. So I'm gonna pause this and now uh, take care of him and then uh, we'll get back in this. So I'm gonna splice a couple things together. So we'll be uh we'll be right back here in just a little bit. We're back and so we're gonna get this thing going again here. Yeah, just non so, in some big situations, Dan, and the offense took full advantage. Unhappy uh, child. Know, one of the things about pitching is you want to have hungry. So I fed him. Day, they want to burp for some reason. My son has trouble burping sometimes. Sometimes my wife can't do it and I can get him to burp. Sometimes it's the other way around, but we take a look at I think he's just a little hungry, so eight, whatever. A lot of Already um, six home I runs also had an idea here when I was feeding him. I'm going to cancel the sign in here and I'm going to swap here it comes. positions with Batista and strike. Morrison. I'm going to take Morrison out. I'm going to put Batista in his spot before I do the pitcher switch. So then uh, we'll be able to Ready go from the there. One pitch. High in the okay. Air the flow with center to center. Uh, fly to center. Excuse me. For the second out of the inning. Okay, for Farmer. Kyle Farmer. He singled earlier, making him one for two to this point. Here's the first pitch to him. This is line to left. Hard hit, but right at the guy. Okay. Yeah, I know I have a pitcher, a position player. Alright, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to take Morrison out. Yep. Okay, so Batista's in. Morrison is out. Really? Time is called and the reliever is warm out there. Yeah, that's what I wanted. What do you mean I gotta sit down? Ugh. Pitch on the way. Okay, so now Morrison has to pitch one. Hit in the air out toward left. <laughs> Adrianza ranging into the outfield. Okay. <laughs> one down. Ugh. Now batting. Now we can shot now. Chris Bryant. He looked to bounce back after striking yes, out put him last again. time up. Trevor Rosenfeld answers the call now, looking to All get right, this one on to the ninth inning without any trouble. First pitch coming, here it is. Lifted in the air out to left. On the run is her. Oh, Batista. Oh no, 
looked like he had it, but it goes right by him. Well, that's not Batista, that's Toscar. Oh, that was bad. Anthony Rizzo stands in now. That's Rizzo not good. Home run and a double from the stretch. Here's the pitch. Oh, oh shit. I better get Iglesias get warmed up. It's the most important pitch in the game, Maddie. I, it puts the hitter on the defensive. I can only think of myself being in the batter's box. When I'm sitting 1-0, I am all over the gas, or I am allowed the opportunity oh. to sit on without fearing going 1-1. When you're down 0-1, your head's on swivel. Fouled off. Here now the 2-2. Lifted the other way to left center. It should be the third out. Adrianza ranges back, and he has it for out number two. Okay. The young catcher Wilson Contreras, and with men on base and two away, it feels like this at bat could go a long way toward deciding this thing. No doubt, Matt. A base hit here changes this game quite a bit. But if they can't score here, it looks pretty bleak for them heading into right, the last come on. couple of innings. Come on. A strike to Contreras, and it's one and one. Yes, two strikes. All right. A strike. All right. Bryant stands at second right, with two guns. Come on, circle change. Boom. Two and two Ooh. to the Cubs catcher. That's All a right, good slider. Take there on 0 and 2. Some umpires have got him. We'll have nice pitch and rolls and all. All right. All right. Now we're going to have a conference at the home plate area, so it would appear that we'll see a double switch here. Steve Ciszek will come on okay, to pitch so here. He'll move into the number five spot in the lineup now on the double switch. Ready and waiting. Scheduled to pitch. Yep. Okay, Andrianza. We have Andrianza, Batista, and Granite, I believe. Oh, one count. Here's the pitch. Ah. Wait back. A swing and a miss. That's just a great pitch right there. Great execution. He just got that hitter to think that pitch was knee high. Nasty diving out of the zone. Now the 0-2 pitch. High in the air Popped out it. to center field. Borges is there. He's got it one away. Jose Bautista will stand in to try it again already with one home run of the ball game and on cue. Here it was, back in the seventh inning, a solo shot that provided quite a spark for these guys. Oof. One out, nobody on. Come on, Batista. Oh, missed another one. Come on. Cubs have someone working in their bullpen <sighs> now as a right hander's begun. Two to pitches hit right there I could have crushed. Oh, you can tell oh what was that? Off, that was bad. Through the inside pitch anyway, and he becomes out number that two. was terrible. Oh, here's Percent Granite. Granite the next How's he hitting? 356. Two hits in four attempts to this point. Yeah, that last at bat, Daddy, he turned that fastball around. He didn't hit it a ton. He didn't hit it a country mile. But hey, listen, a home run is a home run. Now nice. A swing, but he holds up in time. Oh boy. One. Let's go, Zach. One zero count. Here it is, and it's fouled away. Classic change of speeds right there. Threw the hitter's timing off. Got a late foul ball. Interested to see where he goes now. Hit on the ground to third. Right at third base. Bryant man. is up with it. Throw in time, and the side is retired. All right, that's fine. Rysel Iglesias takes the ball now in inning number All right, nine. here we go. Close the door. Ah, he doesn't need warm-ups. We're ready. Striding in to start the nine, Kyle Schwarber, as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. Hit on the ground down the first baseline. But a foul ball here, 0-1. One and nope. one to Schwarber. Let's go with the slide piece here. One one. Swing and a little tapper. A little foul. Okay. Foul. I'm gonna do the slider again. I'm gonna do that back door. And he'll try Ugh. to get 
fishing there, That's but he won't offer in dirt, and it's back to even at two and two. The classic back foot slider right there. There you go. Strikes. Usually gets a ton of swing and misses. Nice layoff right there. Fight for another pitch. Got him to go down swinging there. Kyle Schwarber is retired on strikes for the third time tonight. The next hub up, Chris Jimenez. And he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. And he fouls this one off. Chris Jimenez, former twin. Faces your empty one man. Not very good, to be honest. And he Bye. strikes him out as well. So make it back to back punch outs here to the first two men he faces out of the bullpen. Well, you have to feel pretty confident about the way this one's going to end up as a manager. Two hitters, two strikeouts from the closer. There's not a whole lot more he can do to instill confidence that he's going to wrap this thing up without any problem. Here's Peter Borges standing in as he'll try to hold back on the swing, but he went around for the first strike. His lifetime numbers against Iglesias. He's hitless in three at bat. <laughs> swing and Two a strikes. Miss, and they're up against One away to strike out the side here. And boom. Swing and a miss as they nice job, Iglesias. For that one. And this ball game it's two in a row for the Twins against the Cubs. They slammed the door for the win, and they finished the month with the bang just the way you want to. Five to three, the final score in this afternoon's game. Minnesota get the win despite three errors in the field. Michael Pineda pitches his way to a league-leading 12th win of the year. Rysel Iglesias. We had three the errors? Out of the wow. Bullpen, his Must have been one with Simming because so I don't remember making any errors. Do it. For Mark DeRosa, Dan so, Blizak, and Pineda gets the win. Got a hit, too. MLB, the show. For more, don't forget to check out the show nation. Not bad. Uh, let's see the game recap box score. I want to see who got the errors. No errors. Hernandez. Oh, yeah, I remember the Hernandez one. Rosie got one, and Adrianza got one. Okay. Yeah, I remember the Hernandez one. Okay. Batista. I can't believe that. One inning pitch. He did good. Got one strikeout. Big strikeout. Rosenthal. Went two-thirds. Iglesias went a third. Inning and I actually technically um, Morrison got one, got a, a third too, but he's not listed in there. But that's still, yeah. So, all right, not bad. If you like that episode, hit the like button, leave a comment if you like, subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you next time for episode 15 of MLB The Show 18 for your Minnesota Twins franchise. Until next time, peace out and go Twins.